My name is Adam Smith, um, and I'm a co-founder and the head of strategy at Descartes Labs. What we do is ingest hundreds of different data sets that help quantify and measure the Earth, and we refine that raw input into meaningful information for our partner customers in government and commercial enterprise. The pace of innovation in terms of quantifying our planet physically, whether it's from space or from sensors on the ground, is an exponential curve right now. There will be more satellites launched in the next 18 months than in all of history. And 90% of all the data that exists today was created in the last two years. If your goal is to calculate all of the information as it's ingested, we call it at the rate of collection, you're beyond any purpose-built system. It's really only the commercial cloud with its virtualized compute capacity that can handle that kind of job. There's really three ways that we see AWS uniquely solving our set of challenges. The first is that we need access to all of this raw input from space, from terrestrial sensors, NASA, the European Space Agency, NOAA, most commercial satellite companies. They've chosen AWS as the repository for their raw information. In the future, all new constellations, new sensor data sets have a bias towards coming to AWS, and that data gravity gives us the best chance of finding that raw data where it lives. The second is then the computational intensity issue. We have to process this data as it comes in, and it's hundreds of terabytes a day. Last month, we partnered with AWS to enter our system into the annual competition of the world's largest supercomputers. That's called the Top 500. Through a partnership with AWS, our entry gained the 40th slot, and that's competing with every supercomputer in the world. Having all the data and being able to process it in a partnership with AWS is critical. The third and the last most important component is that a major part of our customer base is the government. The ability to perform in a classified environment and run those workloads where we have the confidence and the authority to operate with our customers is paramount. There's no real alternative for us uh, in able to perform the way that we're meant to without having AWS's environment. This past June, we were able to uncover the construction of a missile silo farm in the Gobi Desert. Because we had the signature of what that looked like, and we're inspecting all of the images as they come down, our system identified that uh, as it was being built.